It is my pleasure to welcome you all to the 144th EC Glass Commencement Ceremony. Graduates, as we begin the ceremony and your names are called out one by one, I hope each and every one of you feels the same sense of pride and accomplishment as I do. Our hard work and dedication has finally paid off. On behalf of the graduating class, I would like to thank our family, friends, faculty, and administration for being here today and celebrating this moment with us. Thank you all. Now please welcome the members of the EC Glass Chamber Singers performing our alma mater. our distinguished guests on stage, family members and friends, I would like to welcome you to our 2017 graduation. We are very happy to have you here. And to the graduates, I would like to say that it is an honor to stand before you again and to give words to another group of students that are leaving the nest. I am privileged to have been your principal and you have served EC Glass well. Class, please join me in thanking Dr. Braybrand for his years of service to Lynchburg City Schools. He and I started together five years ago, and I know sometimes we felt like a hurricane and a tornado together, but in all seriousness, Dr. Braybrand, we wish you well and encourage you to keep the main thing the main thing. <laughs> we got this is an expression that I started using at the beginning of the school year. To be honest, I think it was initially a way of reassuring myself. Then I would tell my admin team. Mrs. Floor printed shirts for us with the words on the back. When I sent out the schedule to the teachers at the beginning of each week, I would end it by saying, we got this. I knew that it had really caught on when I walked by Mrs. Worsham one day in the hall and she said, good morning. And she said, we got this, Dr. Richardson. 
And let me just pause right here and let you know that first of all, Mrs. Worsham has been teaching English in this building for almost 40 years. And And I recognize that it is not the most grammatically correct English, but when she said it, I knew that I could too. It caught on and it became a mantra that this year would be our year. We got this. Parents, we started strong, and those legendary registration lines in August were so much better. We won state titles in the fall for golf and cross country, another in the winter for indoor track, and state titles in individual and duo tennis just this week. I also think it is fitting to acknowledge lacrosse and baseball. They took us to new plateaus this season, and we are equally proud of you. We had an eventful year. In this very auditorium, we celebrated Dr. Roger Jones and our school back in the winter. Former staff members and alumni from far and near came back and there were two things that we heard over and over again. One was how beautiful the building still looked, and secondly, how well behaved and respectful the students were. Some of you went to Project Inclusion and you left feeling like you would change the world. Many of you were a part of the inaugural capstone program. You helped to make us a blue ribbon school for two years in a row because of your straight superior rankings in band, chorus, and orchestra. You reached the state and national levels for History Day and Science Fair competitions. I also want to acknowledge the students who've had to work or take care of siblings instead of being able to participate in extracurriculars because your story is different but you are an integral part of our story. All of this comes together to make this school so unique and so special. All of you have helped revolutionize the way learning took place in this building by bringing words to our vocabulary, such as Chromebooks, Kahoot, Quizlet, and Google. 80 students in this graduating class have a GPA of 4.0 or higher. You earned over $10 million in scholarship offers. You have excelled in the classrooms on the ball fields, at competitions, and most importantly, at being young people that all of us adults have enjoyed being around. Thank you. We got this from our preliminary SOL scores. We have exceeded all of the benchmarks that we need in each area to be fully accredited. <laughs> Seniors, you helped us encourage the entire student body to do well on SOL testing. Some of you made videos. Not only did you want to see Miss Flora in that dress, you also wanted to decorate your caps. Great job. Now, I want to transition from we got this and say that I know that as you are moving forward, that you got this. You will walk out of this auditorium into many different next phases. Many of you will be off to colleges and universities. 
Some of you will postpone graduate, postpone postgraduate education and work first. Some of you will go and keep watch and serve our countries. Whatever it is that you do, we are proud of you and we know that you are ready. Continue to have high expectations. Push yourself and do not settle. Continue to represent your Hilltopper heritage by being shining stars in a world that needs light. Come back and give back to this school. EC Glass will be your home for any time and for all time. At my, in my household, we used to read a book at the close of every day, and so this is the close of our time together. So I would like to read an excerpt from the story there by Marie Louise Fitzpatrick to you. When will I get there? How will I know? Will there be a sign that says here is there? Will it take long to get there? Till tomorrow, till next week, till next year? Will I wear sensible shoes and say sensible things? Will I never, ever say anything silly again? Never, ever, ever? And will I know everything there? Will I know all the secrets? Will I know how to count the stars and how to fix the broken things? Is it a jungle there? Will I find my way through? Will there be dragons? Will they be fierce? Do you know how to tame dragons? I do. You look them in the eye and you count to 10. Then they just fly away. Is everybody going there? Can I change my mind and go elsewhere instead? Class of 2017, your there can be anywhere. You got this, and I love you. It is my privilege to introduce our graduation speakers, who were chosen by the class of 2017. First, we will hear from Aaliyah Walmack, who is planning to study biological sciences at NCNT. Second, oh, dang, I lost my spot. Second, we'll hear from Elena Stem, who will be attending the University of Tennessee to study neurosciences. Our final speaker will be Hope LeFew, who will be attending VCU in the fall. Please give them a big round of applause. Resilience, perseverance, those are the words I live by, and here is why. Most do not know what I've been through, so let me give you a quick outline. Four years ago, I was diagnosed with Stevens-Johnson syndrome, which means I'm allergic to some type of medicine. I was given 48 hours to live, and those moments were crucial. I had to learn how to walk, talk, eat, and much more. After 13 days, I went home two days before my birthday. I'm here to tell you today, nothing is impossible. Nothing is too hard. I never thought that I would be alive today to tell my story in front of my classmates, but we really only live once. Do not let tough obstacles stop you from reaching your dreams. When you feel like your back is against the wall, push harder to prove everyone wrong. I mentioned that resilience is one of the words I live by, well, the dictionary defines it as an ability to recover from or adjust easily to misfortune or change. I encourage each of you today to remember that when life gets tough, because it will, you must adjust yourself to your situation and keep moving. Don't have a pity party, but keep your eyes on your goals and your dreams. 
graduation and my 18th birthday on the same day. <laughs> truly blessed and grateful to see this day. Never let anything stop you because I promise the results will always, always be worth the fight. Thank you. Good afternoon. My name is Elena Stem and over the past four years I've been a part of Spanish Club, Girls in Virginia, Mercy Care, Student Council Association, National Honor Society, and even the president of Glass Theater. While this may seem impressive, the fact is that when I leave this building, none of it will matter anymore. For those of you who are still holding on to the idea that making homecoming court is an achievement that will guide you to success for the rest of your life, it's time for a reality check. While the pomp and circumstance of graduation is fun and all, I'm here to give a glimpse into the world outside of these walls. Reality check number one, once you leave high school, the sports and extracurriculars that you did do not matter anymore. What matters is your character and the skills that you developed from the activities that you did in high school. The principles of time management, leadership, maturity, working with others, volunteering and persevering under pressure will lead you to success after high school regardless of the career you pursue. Reality check number two, you will never be the best. In high school it seems as though everything is a competition. Who can take the most AP exams? Who is in the most clubs? Who has the highest GPA or even has the most followers on Instagram? What matters is being the best you can be, rather than trying to be better than everyone else. In past years, I was upset watching everyone else be great, thinking that I was somehow a lesser person because some subjects were just harder for me than they were for others. Over time, I began to realize that those subjects were just not my strong suit, and there were other areas where I shined. Your best chance at success in life is to find your strengths and not to be concerned about comparing yourself to others. The world would be a quiet place if we were all math wizards and there were no musicians. Reality check number three. You will miss high school. <laughs> I know every graduate on the stage just laughed at me because I just laughed at myself even saying that. You'll miss the football games, the snow days, the pep rallies, the relative security of a closed environment. But most of all, You'll miss your friends. These are people that I've cheered for, whether it was a close score in a conference game, getting the grade they needed on a test, or sometimes even wore, when they wore an especially cute outfit. But these are also people that I've cried with, whether it was a broken heart, a derailed dream, or just the stress of trying to make it out of our extremely competitive environment. Over the past four years, I've built relationships with my classmates and watched them grow into wonderful and capable adults. Today we leave behind everything that we have become familiar with. Although our accolades won't matter once we leave these halls, our relationships and the lessons learned over the past four years will provide us with the framework for success as we move forward. Thank you, and congratulations to the class of 2017. When I was a little girl, I used to love bedtime. Well, I mean, I still do. I guess everyone does. Anyway, I loved it because my mom would read me stories. I would climb into bed in the middle of an army of stuffed animals and listen while she read me stories. She would read me anything from Go Dog Go to Magic Treehouse all the way up to Junie B. Jones. In fact, she read me stories up until this year when I had extra long days or I wasn't feeling too well and still had some reading to do. We would both lay on the couch and she would read them to me. The reason why I started with this little anecdote is because I want to take two things away from this speech. One, I have an awesome mom. And two, stories. Arguably, the stories that matter the most are the ones that compose each and every individual on this stage, in this auditorium, and on this planet. They are stories of struggle, of strife, of triumph, and happiness, and sadness, and emotion, and success, and well, life. On February 4th of last year, I tried to take my own life. A downward slope of depression and anxiety depleted my motivation and my love for all things learning and beautiful. My story is not glamorous and oftentimes is one frowned upon by societal norms if spoken about. There's a stigma that surrounds me and the mental illnesses that I battled, 
one that silences so many voices and so many young people today. I'm not telling you this to make you feel bad for me. I'm telling you this because there are a lot of you that I see every single day who don't know that about me. Which begs the question, what else do you not know about the people that surround you every day? I have an answer, a lot. But the importance of recognizing stories like this is not to try and learn everyone's deepest, darkest secrets. No, the purpose of this is to simply understand that these stories exist. Every day we walk this earth is someone's best day and someone else's worst day. The most valuable thing I have learned and the most valuable advice I can give is to meet every person in life with a smile for you are not to know the battle that they are fighting within. Four years ago, when we entered the halls of glass, timid and young, we couldn't have possibly foreseen everything that would happen to us before today. Countless chapters have been written in each and every one of our stories, but today we share the same one. We share a chapter that graduates us from this school, but we can't forget all the, those who have helped us make today possible. After all this is over, thank those people. That's right. I'm looking at you, Mom. Mom, you are the strongest person I know. Every single day of my life, you have pushed me to be the best person I can be. Without you, I wouldn't be where I am today. So with that, I will leave you with the kind words of Winnie the Pooh. You are braver than you believe, stronger than you seem, and smarter than you think. So follow your dreams, class of 2017, and thank you. Now please welcome the EC Glass Acafellas.
Kayleen Bridget Adams. Travis Jefferson A.G. Seth David Aarons. Benjamin Scott Aylesworth. Jordan Lamar Alston. Blake Carrington Anderson. Desmond D. Andrews. Jasmine Rochelle Andrews. Michaela Bianca Andrews. Nehru Tobias Andrews. <laughs> Treasure Kion Anthony. <laughs> Nimra Asim. Leah Atkins, Mariana Elizabeth Atwell, Tyler Lee Austin, Maynisha. Aviante Bailey. <laughs> Chloe Virginia Bain. <laughs> Thomas McCall Baker. Gabriel Uriah Barley Dean. Robert Daniel Bass, Salutatorian. Samaya Nicole Bateman. Christina Claire Bennett. <laughs> Lindsay K. Bennett. <laughs> Bennett. 
Janasia Renee Bentley. Markayla Amani Berger. Sean Austin Berry. Bianca Alexandria Beverly. Brittany Mayana Blair. Asia Renee Blake. Caitlin Marie Bohan. Demel Maurice Bolden. <laughs> Jeremiah A. Booker. <laughs> Olivia Campbell Boyce. Megan May Brinkley. Chelsea Renee Brown. Kristen Eleanor Brown. Lauren Yvonne Brown. Koshonda Lanisha Brown. Laura Elizabeth Brockner. Paige Brache Brown. Burgess, <laughs> Olivia Lee Burnett, <laughs> Traquan A. Bird, <laughs> Detray Jawan Cabler. Shantaya Deshay Padre. Kayla <laughs> Dominique Callahan. Antonio Ramar Callens. Edward Grayson Carrington. Jalen Wyshawn Carter. Rachel Elizabeth Kate. Michaela Jure Chambers. Jermaine Tavon Cheatwood. <laughs> Ashley Monique Christian. Eric Robert Clopper. Chase D. Cobbs. <laughs> Mayana Simone Cornwall. <laughs> <Kornel. laughs> 
Avery Morningstar Combs. Catherine Lurie Conlon. Austin Randall Cooper. Tyler Stephen Cooper. Virginia Evelyn Corsini. Kurt Davis Cox. Christian Cruz. Carter August Condit. Trenton Gilbert Daly. Devante Lamont Damone. Libby Tyrell Davidson. Jasmine Elizabeth Davis, sorry, Olivia Jude Dennis. <laughs> Leighton Jackson Dodd. Raven K. Dunlap. Leah Elizabeth Evelyn. Janesha Chavez Ellison. Caroline Elizabeth Farrar. Jordan DeAndre Farrow. Carson Elizabeth Ferguson. Tyrese Devell Fitzgerald. Emily Marie Fix. Michael Dale Wiener. Cheyenne Raquel Fleshman Cameron. Nora Dean Florio. Samuel Austin Floyd. Shalia Aikila Foster. Jamie Tyrese Fox. Asia Monet Franklin. Jacob Matthew Fry. Susan Annette Gibson. Frederick Oliver Gilbert. Benjamin Spencer Gillespie. Mariana Jamie Goggins. <laughs> Maxwell Alan Gregory.
Emily Bell Griffin. Rosalina Bordado. Mikhail Alexander Gunther. Anne Marie Lane Gusky. Caroline Lee Gusky. Mary Catherine Guthrie. Shatoria Denisha Hairston. Hunter Shane Hall. Taranza Siobhan Hall. Mary Wayne Hamlet. Jackson Alexander Hanowitz. Nathan Scott Hansen. Valencia Simone Harmon. Jack Roland Harner. Marcus Dequan Harris. Tierra Diamond Harris. Najla Marie Hay. Kayla Nicole Hay. Johanna Jim Heller. Joseph Jontel Michael Henderson. Mark Anthony Hood. Andrew Cole House. Emily Patricia Howard. Laerga Naisha Hubbard. Talia Monet Hubbard. Story Raven Hall. DeAndre Montrell Hunt. Janaya Monet Hurt. Kanisha Monet Hurt. John Hutchison. Dylan Lee Ingersoll. Alexis Jasmine Jackson. Corin Marie Jackson. Zaya Jakaria. Stephen Andrew James. Vladimir Mauricio Garon. Christian Reginald Johnson.
Lakira Tasha Johnson. Ariana Michaela Jones. Don Jewel Jones. Desmond Alexander Jones. Demir Shaheed Jones. Jabari Lewis Jones. Maya Deshay Jones. Joshua Caleb Kalich. Calvin Marcus Keener. Rashawn Wendell Kelly. DeAndre Emmanuel. Elizabeth Marie Kidwell. Reagan Elizabeth Kinder. Alexis Virginia King. Taylor Marie King. Peter William Kistler. Pierre Janae Cottrell. Rebecca Noel Lass. Eliana Inez Lee. Hope Alexandra Lefeu. <laughs> Carter Bryson Leverett. <laughs> Maya Chanel Lewis. Jelani Rashad Ligon. Edward Y. Ling. Leticia Lachieta Lipscomb. Kaylin Murray Lowry. Luke Daniel Manheri. Brooke Denise Mannion. Devante Jameek Marshall. Kenton William Marshall. Rashawn Lamar Marshall. Sydney Marie Marshall. James McKinnon Massey. Elizabeth Ann Matthews.
Jaren Oresha Mayo. Brooke Elizabeth McCall. Connor Ryan McLean. Mary Catherine Elizabeth McCord. Chad Terrell McDaniel. Marquis Raquan McDaniel. Michaela Cecile Isis McDaniel. Kelsey Brianne McKenna. Mitchell Hugh McMahon. Desmond Jamal Meadows. Taylor Sage Meeks. Anna Alexa Mendez Riffy. Alora Catherine Miller. Kaylin Blake Mitchell. Maggie Davis Mitchell. Nyla Renee Monroe. Maya J. Moore. Tegan Rose Moore. Lil Lamont Morgan. Jalen Rashawn Morris. <laughs> Catherine Grace Morris. <laughs> Timothy Lee Mosby. <laughs> Darian Cortez Murphy. Joffrey Smith Murphy. <laughs> Marie Mindy Mutambezi. <laughs> Ebony Monet Mutz. <laughs> Luz Esmeralda Narvano. Maria Rose Navolio. Marshall Cash Neighbors. Alexis Morgan Newman. Kayla Hong Nguyen. James Thomas O'Connell. Austin Kendall Osborne. Hannah Alexis Packett. Graham William Paget. Justin Nicholas Pinnell. Terrell Edward Patterson.
Emily Adele Paulus. Redmond Payne. Janae Ann Payne. <laughs> Nadasia Nicole Payne Moore. Lauren Elaine Peak. Michaela Renee Penix. <laughs> Madeline Jewel Phillips. <laughs> Ethan Mark Pitts. <laughs> Emma. Grace Kadosek. <laughs> Melissa Ann Letty Valedictorian. <laughs> Carlton Simeon Purvis. <laughs> Caitlin Emily Quinn. Anna Marie Rangwin. <laughs> Madeline Grace Renison. <laughs> Jerrica Amber Reynolds. <laughs> Nuha Riza. Jasmine Lai Richards. Henry Mason Riffey. Tyler Damon Ross. Keller Bruce Royer. Talisha Nicole Rudolph. Lane Catherine Jerry, Jamie Deshay Russell, Michaela Irene Salerno, Emily Virginia Salmon. Malik Sanders, Nicholas William Sorantos, Benjamin James Clyde Sasser, Thomas Cooper Scott. Jacob Coleman Selden. Zaire Jesse Shelton. Daniel Gross Simon. Robert Layton Simonton. Kayla Michael Slaughter. Nautica Victoria Smith. Noah Kanapo Smith. Sophie.
Caleb Lamar Spinner. Kevashti Andrea Springer. Brandon Eugene Staley. Morgan Taylor Stamps. Elena Catherine Stem. Elizabeth Marie Stevens. Andrew Jordan Stokes. Nahaj Stone. Charles Henry Story. Julia Andrea Straka. Leon A. Strange. Colin David Super. Kenya Desire Tabor. Zion Amir Tanner. Harris Amor Ingles Tate. Tiriana A. Taylor. Marisha Dominique Thomas. Ava Marie Torres. Elizabeth Colvin Tugman. Nicholas Reed Underwood. Dorothy Athalia Vasquez. Jaleel Caesar Walker. Sydney Meredith Walker. Amaya Waller. Ladesha Marie Ware. Trailion Edward Ware. Joseph Jarrell Cleek White. Ayana Maria Williams. Tyreek Dequan Williams. Quante Lapree Wilson. Ian Young Winston. Aaliyah Shanice Womack. Peter Wesley Woods. Brianna Nicole Woodson. Shaheen Leon Wright. And Zachary Scott. 
Scott Young. Good afternoon, everyone. Before we close today's ceremony, I would like to thank all of the family, the friends, and the EC Glass staff for helping me and my fellow graduates through the, our journey. Although we close the door on this chapter of our lives, we open a bigger door that leads to endless opportunities. From here, we apply the knowledge and all the wisdom we've gained throughout this wonderful journey. Even though we're all going our separate ways, we'll never forget the memories we've made and the last we shared. It's been a hell of a ride. And to my fellow graduates, I would like to say congratulations, we finally made it. Before I take my seat, I would like to give a special shout out to my mom. For, the, for all the love and support, I wouldn't be here if it wasn't for you. Thank you, mom. And lastly, I will see all of you at the cabin tomorrow. Class of 2017, please rise for the main thing. By the powers vested in me by the Lynchburg City School Board and the Commonwealth of Virginia, I declare you graduates.